Hey guys, we're at the event today. Um, this is the last day of the event, so it should be um, very useful and everything. And yeah, you see the background there? So, this has been a really uh, interesting time, and I think uh, growing and scaling your business is a big thing, and you have to have systems in place for it. So, that is what we're going to be learning today, strategies, and doing that. And, and we'll vlog some more after this, but this is uh, the first day of the vlog, so stay tuned. great experience. Uh, I think we're a little bit premature in our overall business to really be able to utilize a lot of the tactics within it, but it definitely builds a great foundation and uh, that's one of the main reasons why I want to go there and do this. Sit car. But yeah, uh, so we're in the Dallas downtown area right now. Uh, yeah, going to break our fast with, uh, with some food. Not really sure what we're gonna eat just yet, but we're gonna eat something. So, we're at this place called the Iron Cactus here in Dallas, Texas. Iron Cactus. Uh, got the Don, and we did some type of like Mexican martini thing where like, it's kinda like, you know, getting a bucket of beer or something. Yeah, it comes in a shaker like this, for like $4 more, and then you just keep filling up your glass, which is super dope. Um, yeah, this might be like one of those one meal a day type of uh, days today. So we're breaking our fast with this here. Ate some chips, ate some salsa, having this martini thing. Let's go ahead and pour us one real quick. Day here in Dallas, probably. Still debating whether we're leaving tonight or whether we're staying or what we're doing. Uh, we don't know just yet, but I figured it'd be a good idea to probably drive back tonight and maybe spend the day with the kids before I gotta go back to the 9 to 5 job. So that's kind of a big deal, but uh, yeah. Also, we're probably gonna go way over on our calories because of having this drink, eat some chips, and all that good stuff. We did order fajitas, so those should be pretty good on our macros and whatnot and not completely blow it out, but I only got 1,300 calories a day, and I've used this vacation as just an overall cheat, and haven't been like staying on top of things, so, you know, gotta get back on track. So, as you can see, we got this food here. Uh, looks pretty good, pretty good. We got some, we got some enchiladas, look at those enchiladas, those bomb diggity. Hot. <laughs> I got some heat, and mine's still sizzling, check it out, listen to it. Boom, fajita. This little soupy thing right here. Uh, check it out. I've never had it before. Uh, I'm try it I don't know. Sorry guys, I'm chopping it up. Sorry. Got a nice little fixing to the sides. Probably gonna stay away from the cheese. You know, cheese is not a big thing for me. That's why I probably don't care for pizza all that much. But hey, it is what it is. Ah, what is going on, guys? Sorry about the terrible audio quality. I know this terrible audio quality in the beginning of this video. Maybe terrible audio quality in the end of this video because I'm still not using the shotgun mic. Uh, I think it has a lot to do with the wind. I don't know. I don't know why it just sounded so horribly all of a sudden. But uh, cause that's what we've been using this camera with like no external audio pretty much this entire trip. So yeah, I don't know what the deal is, but hey. Ow. <laughs> it is what it is. Check out the swim pool area. Sick AF, dude. Uh, yeah, just gonna enjoy it a little bit before we head up out of this thing because this is our last day here and uh, last day here. Well, we got a few more hours left. We're gonna try to try to roll out this evening, so. Maybe, we might leave tomorrow. Yeah, try to get us maybe a little bit of cardio in before we go. Having a dope little, epic little hot tub area over here. 
uh, pretty sweet. Probably one of the most enjoyable things down here. Went to the swimming pool area for a little bit, and it's just cold, dude. It's cold. The weather, I mean, it's kind of like warm out, but the, the water's like ice cold, so it's like, doesn't really feel all that great. And then you got this. Look at this. I don't know if y'all can see it very well, but I mean, it's epic. Look at that. Look at that. So we're gonna post up here for a little bit. Relax, enjoy this thing. And, uh, I'm gonna pack up after this and go ahead and back to the bill. Time for a little hot tub physique update. Uh, yeah, physique probably looking garbage right at the moment because you know, just having to stay on top of the diet and everything. But overall, I think I'm looking good. I'm just not looking nowhere near competition ready. So let's check it out. There you go, hot tub physique update. I won't be able to do that on a weekly basis because I don't want a hot tub, nor do I have access to a hot tub. So, this is a one-time exclusive. Hopefully you've seen this. Hopefully you want to see more physique updates and you hit that sub alert button. Change the way that your hand grip is going based on which way you're facing in the wall, in towards the wall or away from the wall. Uh, grab it from right here. Do your chest fly type of movements. I don't know how useful this would be. I'd have to work out on this for a little bit, but you could definitely get a decent little workout from this thing. And I just think it's super freaking unique. And uh, to be honest, like, at some point in time in my career, I might design some type of equipment that's somewhat like this. I want it to be even more technologically advanced. I want it to track your workouts. I want it to do pretty much anything and everything you can potentially think of. But that's in the future. Until then, we're just going to keep grinding on this YouTube grind, grinding on the apparel grind, and trying to keep up with that. Alright guys, so we made it home hey. safely. Uh, Fit. Overall, really good trip. Came home, grilled out. What are you doing taking my plate, bro? Oh. <laughs> but, Fit. came home, went to the grocery store quick, grilled out. Got some squash here, got some chicken here. We actually did pork chops as well. Check it out. 
spoon. Mom, I'm supposed to chew my food. Harry got this. We're going to eat it. Mom, it but you guys good. But yeah. We're going to end this vlog here. We had a really good trip, like I said. Uh, thank you guys if you watched all our other vlogs. And if you have not yet, go ahead and check them out. And hit that subular button because we're going to be doing poverty meal prep. And we'll show you guys how to make meals like this. And overall, just give you all good meal ideas to keep you on top of your diet. Keep you on track of your diet and everything. So yeah, stay tuned, guys.